Hey everybody, my name is Beke Mulak. I'm from Saarland University, and I want to give you a quick introduction into our topic. So the background of our studies was that filler particles like uh and um in English orientate listeners' attention to the following speech material, and they also lead to better recognition when the word occurs again. Filler particles also lead to improved recollection of the following word, and they lead to improved recollection also on discourse level. And this last finding by Frauenhoff and Watson was particularly interesting to us, so we decided to try to replicate their findings. We conducted two experiments, one with German data and one with English data. And for both experiments, we had three different short stories of Alice in Wonderland, and we manipulated uh, the stories according to the conditions we used. So for the German experiment, we had a fluent condition, a filler particle condition, and a long silence condition. And for our English data, we had a fluent condition and two different filler particle conditions. So the filler particles we spliced in there uh, differed in duration. Both of these experiments were conducted as web-based experiments. So the subjects listened to the stories and afterwards they recorded themselves while retelling these stories. After that, um, we listened to their answers and scored the stories manually. We found an improved recall effect for the fluent condition of the German data, but we didn't find any effect of condition for our English experiment. Both of these findings, of course, are in contrast to Frauenhoff and Watson, who found an improved recall effect for the filler particle condition. A possible explanation would be the different study design. Uh, Fraundhoff and Watson did their study in a laboratory and we had, had a web-based web -based experiment. And of course, in a web-based experiment, you cannot ensure participants' concentration. For future work, we are still looking into different study designs to test the recall effect of the particles. Thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you all at our poster.